You scream like a girl. No, I don't. I have a sore throat. Liar. Anyway, I'm you from the future. I knew that. Liar. How could you have possibly known that? It's the only reasonable explanation for a mini version of me to be inside of a shoebox. Oh. I never thought of it that way. You're smarter than you look. See? Wait. Anyways, so I'm here to talk to you about the Jordan Future. It drops on Saturday. I know that. Well, did you know it has 3M on the woven upper? Duh. Jordan 11 bottom? Yep. Two colorways? Knew it. Did you read Brett's article on the shoe? Huh? And you call yourself a friend. But I- hey. ah! You scream like a girl. No, I don't. I have a sore throat. Right. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to a version of myself from the future about the Jordan future. You mean you're talking to a shoebox? No. Look. Oh, darn. All right, guys. So I just wanted to have a little bit of fun there, but let's get into the shoe. So this is the Jordan Future. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen this shoe before already. It is a lifestyle offering from Jordan Brand. Um, it's kind of like an NSW version of Jordan Brand, but Jordan Brand is simply calling it off court. So this is the first of two versions. There's going to be an infrared version and there's going to be a glow version, but let's get into the details. As I was saying, Jordan Brand is launching the shoe with two colorways, the infrared and the glow. Now, both pairs sport a black woven upper with 3M lacing throughout. Something that has not been highlighted is the deconstructed suede lining in the future. It helps to give the shoe a very comfortable feel. You can tell Jordan Brand paid a lot of attention to the details. You can see that the leather tag on the tongue with the small jump band logo, as well as the suede patch that's on the heel. Now, they also included wax laces and screw-on metal lace tips, which give the shoe a very high-end sort of feel. Now, one of the most obvious parts of the Jordan Future is the outsole, the midsole, the last, whatever you want to call it, the midsole and the outsole, and that's from the Air Jordan 11. Jordan Brand did a great job of taking what I would say is the essence of the Jordan 11 and putting it into the Jordan Future. One thing you don't really want is brands transforming a, a, an iconic shoe like the Jordan 11 into a lifestyle version. So I felt like they took a great part of what we all think of the Jordan 11 and what we see when we see the Jordan 11 and putting it into this shoe and making it for an off-court purpose. So we don't think of we don't think of the Jordan 11 when we see this shoe, but we feel the Jordan 11. If that makes any sense to you guys at all, uh, but I think Jordan Brand did a great job with that. Also. So something that I wanted to point out to you guys is that this is the premium version of the shoe. So the first two, the red, infrared and the glow, they're going to be premium versions and they have the 3M and those are going to cost $185. But down the line, later in the year, most likely this summer, they're going to have a $150 version of the shoe and they have some really terrific colorways and materials coming up that I think you guys are really going to like. All right, guys. Well, before I get out of here, I want to know what do you think about the Jordan Future? Let me know down in the comments. Personally, I really like the shoe. I like where where it's taking Jordan brand. I don't want to say that it's taking Jordan brand in a different direction, but I feel like it's expanding the scope of Jordan brand and allowing some lifestyle and non-performance product that looks really nice and has sort of a luxury feel to really fit into the brand. And this is a good start in my opinion, but you guys let me know how you feel down in the comments. Of course, why don't you go ahead and subscribe that way, you know, whenever something awesome is happening right here on this channel and share it if you like, you know, that way you can let other people know about these videos and about the Jordan future. Well, I I am your host, Jacques Slade, and this is Today in Sneaks all about the Jordan future. All right, guys, as always, I appreciate you, and I'll see you soon. Peace.